Yeah, I'm Alan here, once again from the Ironox uh, Ditnow Mantis family. Uh, in this segment here I'll be demonstrating a technique which is well known to the uh, Mantis uh, schools and Mantis practitioners, whether you're just a beginner or, or, or not. But it's a technique called Fung Sao, which uh, is translated in English basically, for a better word, is wind hand, which works circular motions, and we use this in the uh, Mantis. What I want to basically do is demonstrate and uh, show you, for example, how many different variations of this technique, which is one technique can be used. And uh, that's what we're going to basically do here. Yeah? So that just goes straight in. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, so basically, we use this technique in many different ways. Yeah? Uh, one of them, for example, which normally in now, really, to be fair with you, we don't really use it as a, a defensive. But we can use it as a defensive. And then if you strike this, the attack, catch. And we can send them, right, yeah? And that's using the same circular motion for the full south, right, yeah? The same technique can also be used aggressively, as in to basically attack. Oh, yeah? So you may attack in, yeah? Oh, full south. You attack the back of the neck. Oh, 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 yeah? As well as that, you can be a bit more, uh, even harsh, I'd call it even a bit more harsh if you go for the eyes. It comes in, yeah? Same. You attack the eyes, right? As you can see here, yeah? Okay? The technique can also be used, like, as you can see, that's a closing, that's more of a closing method, but it can also be used to open. Yeah? So you can come in, you can open, come in again, open. You may recognize this, uh, from what we did earlier on the other day, yeah? As well as that, basically speaking, Fungsar can be used on its own. You can use a uh, friendly hand, which is two hands, or you can use one hand on its own, yeah? So for demonstration purposes, again, he's going to attack in whichever hand he chooses to attack in, you attack in, yeah? One, he attacks in. Two, yeah, attack it. This thing can be a closing. So for example, as you can see, that was opening. Yeah, comes in, it comes in again. This is closing. Close that technique. In reality, when the technique actually comes in, you have been in there and you'd have struck instantly at one particular point. You know what I'm saying? The interesting about this technique is obviously many schools use this differently. You know, many guys use this uh, technique in many different ways. When I first uh, learned this technique, I wasn't sure what it was for. After learning the form, for example, in the form, it goes like this. Yeah? Comes down here and be open. But the main thing is this technique, of which is circular technique. That can basically be used in, in the Kung Fu system. And can be used in many various different variations. For example, like he may throw a kick in. So he threw a kick in. Yeah? Same technique can be used here. As you can see, that'll simply send the guy flying. Whichever leg basically comes in, this technique can also be used to defend down and upwards, you know? So of course, yep, yeah, that's pretty much uh, Fung Sao and some of what uh, Fung Sao can do. Again, you know, the variations for Fung Sao, many different variations for it. But uh, like I said, the way we do it in Iron Ox Mandis is very different to the way other schools do it. For example, maybe Chu Ga or Chao Ga, Jukla X, Y and C. Maybe do it same technique, but different. Like I said, we're full circle. So, I'm interested to see if anybody can uh, sort of, you know, post some videos of some of what they basically do in their mental school and see whether or not they, uh, their technique is, uh, well, it's going to be the same technique, but how they basically applicate them. But for now, for Dit now, for Mantis signing out, you know, and uh, we'll catch you on the rebound and we'll do a few more videos of a few more applications of uh, various techniques. So, take it easy.